imaging pieces of the DNA from ancient mammoth specimens with modern living elephant cells, and then if possible, we'll wake those into elephant mammoth hybrids. There is a lot of carbon in, in the permafrost. If it released, it would be more than the sum of all the carbon in the atmosphere right now. It's a very natural thing for elephants all over the world to change their environment, favoring the grasses over the trees. There's no reason to suspect that mammoths wouldn't have a similar, really important role. Exposing that upper surface to the very cold winter air is critical. But if the animals are there, they dig through that snow to get to whatever green grass is underneath. Mammoths are an opportunity to keep global warming from possibly spiraling out of control, and anything we can do to push that in the right direction is really great. Science fiction isn't going to save us. Changing the way we act, the way we behave, the way we interact with the land around us, that's what we need to do. We have reindeer, horses, moose, muskox, bison, yaks. like we've now given bisons a whole new lease on life. Making an elephant cold resistant would probably save the species. This technology, the ability to take genes from the past, put them into species that are alive today, has tremendous potential as a new tool for conservation.